Hello everyone and welcome back to my gaming channel. My name is the Uncover Gamer and we are going back into the darkest dungeon. Now we're going to try and see if we can survive after that grueling first episode. Let's jump on right in. I suppose Musketeer Hero Class, Butcher adds a new circus and multiplayer battles. Okay, we're not going to worry too much about doing the multiplayer. Right, we're going to go straight in into the campaign. Now, if I can remember, the first one went a little bit shaky. We did get some new items. We've got our first four heroes and we completed our first official dungeon. Now, let's see what's uh, up next. Okay, so we're back in after that lovely dialogue. <laughs> so I have, I believe, um, enabled the DLC for the Butcher's Circus. So let's see what happens here. Okay, you can go to the circus to fight multiplayer battles. I'm trying to talk here. You done? Okay. It is completely independent from the estate. Your heroes and trinkets in the circuit are separate circus are separate and will not impact your single player progress. Progress you make in the circus, including your rank, banner design, and any rewards you unlock will carry over to other campaigns as long as you are logged into the same account. Okay. Whoa. So is this all the stuff that I unlocked for my other two campaigns? I can't recall, but um, I think... Refashion your banner. How do I get out of here? Ah, we're gonna, just going to return to the hamlet because that's a whole lot to digest in one. And I'll, um, I'll look into that some more offline. So, one of our heroes is currently in the abbey i believe i put her in yes so i need to recruit someone else so let's go to the stagecoach and ooh, let's see what you do what are your attacks stab blight back to and so she's slow well she basically can be anywhere it seems Ideally, actually, you know, uh, second to last or last. Um, let's see. Deadly, plus two crit. Percent crit. Plus four speed on first round. Is afraid of beasts and has minus 10% max HP. Right, let's see who else we've got here. Houndmaster. He's got a dog. So, bleed. I think I would like some bleed. Um, you can either, so it's not too damaging where he's positioned. Ideally, he needs to be in second or third. And that's replacing this character. And where did you want to be? You can be second or third. You are mainly blight, but you heal and you increase resistance. So you're more like a, um, a support, I suppose. We've already got a highwayman, I don't think we need two of them. Even though he might have different attacks. Yes, he does. I believe I might get the houndsman. His preferred position is second, but it's not too damaging. Let's see, base attacks done. Where do you prefer? You can be in third then, so I can change you around. So I believe I will create you. A lawman and his faithful beast. Item plus twenty percent debuff resist minus two dodge. Okay, I'm not gonna worry too much about that at the moment. I think we're gonna head out into the ruins. So it's circling this one because oh that's because of what's selected. A skirmish is short, medium, medium, apprentice level one. They can be killed, they can be defeated. 
I can't really see what monsters I'd be up against, whether it's humans, depending on the rewards. Plus 10% melee. Melee? Melee. Plus 20% max health. That would be good, but I don't I didn't bring that character. Ah, I need to swap you and put you in there. Um so I have to complete 100% of the battle rooms for all of them. So you know what? Let's just go for a short one. I don't have too much. Brave increases the hound's vigor. Vigor, vigor for a short time. So we're gonna bring a shovel. We're gonna bring eight, as it recommended. Uh, a key, a key. No, we won't bring a key. We'll bring one bleed, and we'll bring six torches. Right. Let's hope this goes better than the first time. Now that I've actually brought a bandage not that that's gonna do much and we're in and what better place to begin than the seat of our any time details showing all the heroes quirk skills and resistances did I check what yours were Plus 20% stress in cold. 10% scout chance and 15% damage in well. I don't. Minus one speed. So I'm going to select you because is your. Oh, your dodge is. It's pretty much the same. What's your health? You've got more health, so I think I'll put you up for risk. Alright, so we have to. Huh. Here goes my shovel. Even the cold stone seems bent on so passage. we have to defeat all enemies. Let's do this. Mechanism, please dodge. Ah, oh, darn it! I can stop his bleeding. Yeah, I'd rather, I'd rather get rid of his bleeding. Let's progress. So I can light the torch before I enter the room, so that. Oh, that's gonna pull him. No. It's not a pull forward. That's a lot of stress. My goodness. Uh, so, let's see what we got here. Gravelord slash bayonet jab. She adds a lot of stress. So you don't want... You're not very helpful with bleeds. So, I can mark a target. He's good with mark targets, actually. So that might help me out. How much damage would I do? 3 to 6, not much so I think I'll target you so that when my ma my highwayman attacks he'll do more damage wonderful now blight what's your blight resistance so it might be worth lighting them oh that's gonna stun them what's your stun I think I'd rather try and stun them first wonderful that's amazing but he's stunned stop pretty quickly. So increased damage for blight. Uh, 5 to 10. 6, that's a better chance. And I only got 6. That's not a good result. Now since I don't have my healer, it's a bit dangerous. Because now I have nothing to rely on except for food to heal them. Ah, right, let's see. So, 5 to 9, I'd rather try and take her out. That's good. Oh, she was stunned. That's perfect. Yikes. Um, stun resistance already high. We can get rid of her. Is there a double attack I can have? No, let's just get rid of her. And because she's already bleeding when it comes around to her turn I won't need to worry so much about her taking up space uh, that's that's saddening actually let's increase your speed hmm 
What does that do? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh. That's not what I meant to do. Um. I can increase his speed again. There we go. That is exactly what I wanted. I can get rid of him. So I might as well. Ooh. Okay, still strong. Still going strong. Beautiful. Let's take what we can. Light the torch. And we're scouting. I think it's also important to light the torch before you click on the map. Because if you click on the map and then light the torch, your chances of um, scouting are lowered. Lowered? Lowered. Oh, why am I saying words so weird? Okay, so I think with this, it's better to just whammy them. Oh, good, 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 good. I think the chance for damage is low. No, chance of damage or doing damage is low. But they do, they do damage. Five to nine. Do I want to, yeah. Oh, no. Let's see, we can, what's your stun? Ah, oh, stun resistance is 100%. Light is low. Oh, but they... If I can... Can I? Can I? Can I? No, I can't. Let's get rid of these two. Can I get to attack before? That would be wonderful if I could. Please? Yes. Ah, uh, that does nothing. Let's... What's your speed? What is your speed? Ah, uh, who's faster? Ah, oh, let's go with him. I don't think he was the fastest. It might be my highwayman. I'll have to check who's fastest, so... Speed is 9. Oh, your speed is 1. You are not fast at all. Four. So the highwayman, if I want to get rid of someone quickly, is my best chance. Oh dear. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Great. I think I like the torch. Oh, uh, stress, 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 stress. I have to remember he's highly stressed. I shouldn't take too many chances with him. Okay. Not surprised. Oh, Ooh, tempting goblet. Does that? That's a that's a high stress. No, only one. Oh, not the front. That's not good. Can I? You don't like being at the front. That's gonna mess everything up. Ooh. Okay. Best thing to do is probably try and bleed them. Once you bleed, it's extremely high resistance. Uh, four to seven damage. Maybe it's worth. Uh, she does so much stress. I think it's worth trying to get rid of her. Oh, that's not good. Uh, stun chance. Yeah, let's try and stun them. Wonderful. Now, mm, might be worth pushing you back. These cell self increase. Accuracy base. I don't think you're going to be much help to me. I think I need to move you back one. Oh, bump in the night. Oh, it's not good. Four to eight. Increase my chances of getting rid of him. I'd rather that. Now, let us increase your speed. Perfect. And now, we will try and oh that's yes 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 perfect 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 okay so i can try and stun you get you out of the way a little bit great and i will send an attack on you 
Even though he's gonna resist it. But now I can damage. Another one Wonderful. Absolutely amazing. He's still stunned, which is fantastic. So let's increase your speed again. What? I thought you were still stunned. Oh no. And this is why it's good to choose a short campaign. <laughs> I'm already stressed. Let's take everything. Purchase all the evil, restores purity, increases resistance. I don't think there's anything here that can really help. Oh dear. Alright, let's put you. Um, let's do my default reordering. I'm not, I'm just going to keep going. I'd rather avoid a battle, but no matter where I go, I'm going to run into a battle. Okay, spitters and webbers. Good. Stunned. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to bump the mic. I think it's worth just trying to do as much damage. And that, that is great. They are... No, eh, the blights. That's a good chance to blight them. Um... Oh, that's done. Uh, let's just get rid of him. Great. And we'll get rid of you. And we'll get rid of you. Might as well try and double whammy them. Lovely. Here's food. I think I'll give you one and I'll give you one. There we go. Right. Mm, only an item coming up. Let's turn the light on. As the light gains purchase, Empty. Spirits are lifted and purpose is made clear. Let's go. So hopefully. Oh, this last room will be the end. Oh, dear. He's highly stressed. Oh, please be good. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. Cut me again, villain, my humor. What does that do? When heroes can't take the stress anymore, they become afflicted. The, this manifests into different behaviors and stat changes. Afflictions last until you send them to treatment in town, unless you can reduce their stress to zero during the quest. Let's see. Affliction muscle kiss stick. So what does that do? Oh, it decreases. Is it decreases the resistances? Lower health. Okay. Because he likes the pain? I don't know. Yes, let's eat. Ah, oh, beautiful. I do like when that happens when I have enough food. So you are a better chance because you are a plague doctor. So I'd really, with the chemist and things like that, or any benches of that sort, I'd rather put those who are more resistant, such as plague doctor, to uh, blight to do do those actions. Okay, let's turn eight. It might be worth just trying to clear them. What does that do? Crit crits receive chance plus four. That's not very high. Five to ten. I could try and blight. What's his blight chance? I could try and blight him. Just to get rid. Oh dear. That's not good. Oh, I might lose. I might lose some people here. I'd rather try and stun them. Honestly, they've got a low stun resistance. And now just to probably try and clear them. So I think I'll go 3 to 6, 4 to 7. Let's just try and clear the front. Good, good, good. That's great. That's fantastic. Oh no. Ooh. 48. Okay, so it's a good chance I'll get rid of him. Stun stopped. Um, 2 to 4. I might just take my chances to just do some sort of damage. Chris received chance decreased. Um, what's your... Oh, your stun's increased. His stun hasn't increased though. He's still stunned. But yeah, it's not increased, so I'll try and stun him again. 
Okay. And we at 47, that's not high. So I think I'll just get rid of him. Now it's a little bit more difficult here because I could get rid, yeah. I'll push them forward a bit. Don't, oh. I was able to hold them off for a while, which is good. Let's get rid of Oh, yes. I love when that happens. <laughs> that makes me so happy. Oh, what did I use that for? That wasn't very smart, but can we stun it? Stun him. And when one is a healer, one is nearly. Im Why would you do that? Let's increase your speed. And let's get rid. Take all. <gasps> yes. Right. Let's get what we can. Oh dear. Oh, beautiful. So I'm not going to bother keep progressing. I think I'm just going to leave that there. Thank God for that. <laughs> that was hard. And that's just an, a normal green, which I'm going to assume is easy, or medium skirmish. Medium difficulty, not as in length. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, minus five virtue chance. So I think that's when he gets tested. It has a lower chance of being good. Or in claustrophobic, severe fear of enclosed spaces. Plus 15 stun resistance and plus 15 damage in warrens. Okay, well, we survived for another week. Oh, I've got a headache. <laughs> that was stressful. Over time, some negative quirks will lock into place and become severe. Severe negative quirks cost more to remove in sanitarium. Right, so she's looking much happier. I'm gonna get you some help. So where do you... you don't have any preferences, do you? Let's, let's get you into gambling. I think the more it costs, the more it reduces the stress, if I'm correct. Right, let's see. We've got you back. You like second, fourth. Um, not second and fourth, last and fourth. So I can put you in the back. That's perfectly fine. Yeah, you'll be in the back. Uh, let's check out what we got here. What items do we pick up? Plus 10% damage for melee skills. So I think minus 4 dodge. What's your dodge like? It's pretty low anyway. But you really are my only melee character. So I think I'll give you that. I'd rather more damage than dodge. If I can... That would be bad as well if I do that. Um, debuff resistance. Who's got you've got high enough dodge to spare some. So that means your buff resistance has increased. Let's see. Does it say what does it give me a trinket? Ah. Plus twenty percent, okay. I don't know what the debuffs does, but it does something. Make no mistake. Upgrade. Drag a hero from the roster here. Allow skill Our upgrades to rank 2. Ready. Reduces cost of skill training by 10%. I think I'd like a cheaper cost. So, I think I'll do that again. Armor. I think I'd like some armor. What's the cost? Reduces cost. Let's reduce some more. And that's that. Let's see what we got here. I want him to have more armor. Armor smitting level one. Oh dear. 
things I messed up. So I can't do any of that. Let's see combat skills. Let us... Oh, I might do you actually. I think I might want Grapevine Master... Instruct mastery. Oh no, I'm gonna have to go back in. Okay, so that's great. <sighs> so I messed up and didn't look at what things costed before I tried to upgrade them. So, can I upgrade? No, I can't do any of that. Guild blacks. Oh, so that's a shortcut there. So that's just the cost. So I've unwittingly messed up uh, let's see what's up next the shop for rare items plus 20 minus 20 percent chance to be surprised that's pretty good but that's a lot of money reduces cost of tree increases number of trinkets available i do have some to spare Idol, amulet, or lucky charm. that is a lot of money but i don't want to be surprised be so your speed is non-existent anyways. Um, your high speed. You're not bad. I think chances are I want you with me. So I'll put that on you. And anyway, uh, I think I'll end the episode here. Thank you for watching. I'm glad that we've survived another week. And I hope this continues. So I'll be seeing you.